This video will show you how to translate a document in MemoQ using Kantan API. Install the Kantan API connector on MemoQ. For more information on this, please watch the related video tutorial. Launch the API to have the automatic translation option enabled for your project. To do this, click Options and then select Machine Translation from the left menu. If you want all segments to be provided with an automated translation suggestion, select the option Always. After you find the CantonMT plugin in the list, click Options. Then select the engine you want to use from the drop down menu and click Launch API. The API status will change from offline to initializing. When the API is launched, the status will change to running. Click OK. Make sure that the Enable plugin box is checked. Then click Apply and OK again. Now you are ready to translate. Open a project or create a new one. To do this, click New Project, add the document you want to translate, select a template from the drop-down list, give a name to the project and select the source and target language. Open the document to translate in the editor by double-clicking the document in the Documents tab. Whenever you click any of the editable target language fields, you will see the automated translation suggestion highlighted in orange popping up following your translation memory fuzzy matches, if there are any. If you want to pre-translate your document with your machine translation output, you would need to go to Preparation at the top menu and click Pre-translate. A window will pop up where you can select the scope of the pre-translation and make sure that the option Use Machine Translation is enabled. Once the process is finished, the whole document will be pre-translated and ready for post-editing. If you encounter any problem or need help, please contact us at support at